Hey guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. What's up? What's popping? Dumana, like I. So this video is gonna be uh, the river review. I'll be focusing on Dumi and Denny's scenes. So lately. A lot has been happening between these two. Like we saw, uh, London found out that Dumi has been cheating on him with his cousin Mabuto. And that did not go well as I suspected. However, Dumi is now trying to do damage control. Not actually trying to save her marriage, more like trying to save her reputation and what people say about her in the food way. Because now that she's so used to the high life, the good life that she's been living ever since she moved in with her mom, She's now trying to backtrack all the mistakes that she has done just to stay face or to look somehow good again in people's eyes. So she went back to Rufile and she went back to her aunt's house where she's like, Oh, I know that I made a mistake, but I want to get back Rendani and I love him. I want us to sort all of the problems out. Go! What are you thinking? Do you actually think after all the bullcrap you have put Rendani through, he's going to take you back? Oh, his family is going to understand where you are coming from. I don't think so. I totally don't think so. For example, like I said in my previous video, Paulina will not stand for any bullcrap that comes from through me. She even went to uh, Lindu's house and asked to me to stay away from her brother because he's now an emotional wreck and she does not want to me to be near her brother which i totally understand if i was in paulina's shoes i would do the same i mean to me went all the way she lied through her teeth. People asked her more than once and she was cheating. And she found it so comfortable to just lie to their faces and think it won't come out. What was she thinking? Oh, now that everything's falling apart and no one wants to do anything with you and wants nothing to do with you, you're now trying to stay face and apologize and say it was a mistake. So when she got to her aunt's house, she realized that, uh, that they've been taking care of Maboto and she's like, Oh, I don't think it's a good idea that Maboto is here. I'm trying to save my marriage. Really? Really? To me? Are you actually going to stand there with her blonde platinum hair and her cocky attitude and say, oh, I'm trying to save my marriage. You're not trying to save your marriage. To me, London is nothing to you. Like your aunt said, you're trying to save your reputation, not your marriage. To make things worse, you want 
your aunt to speak on your behalf. You're basically asking her to validate your, your stupidness. Nah, man, that, that's just out of hell. You're just being a total spoiled brat, which I don't find really attractive anymore. Like, your innocence has been so robbed that you're trying to get it back. It's not going to come back. You've become a different person. So... Now, Lindani is at a place where he wants nothing to do with Lumi. He's now asked for a divorce, which, low key, I didn't expect it, but I also expected it. Do you get it? I don't think, I didn't think that he would come with the idea this soon, but he did. So he is now sending the divorce papers at um, to me and say, you need to sign these, okay? Sign these because I'm done. To me, say, please, oh, Linda, I'm sorry. I love you. Hey, I love you. You don't love him. Get out of here, man. So he's now, he's washing his hands off to me. And he's now trying to live his best life. And... As he should, I think he should now think about his own well-being and not to me because to me is not thinking about his well-being, but herself. So I'm at a place where I think if Landini wants to divorce to me, then he should go ahead because this guy has gone through a lot for to me. Bullets, nearly being killed, saving to me. Okay, nah, to me she should not learn her mistakes come with consequences and she's, she needs to learn. I think she should become a better of a spoiled brat, but she needs to be humbled a bit. She needs to remember how it feels to go through the struggle again. She's lost that mentality of how it feels to be in the struggle and to fight for your life all day long. Because she's now living the high life at her mom's house. That's it. What? Uh, that's it. Like, totally, that's it. So, anyway, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share if you want. Peace. I'm out.